Yo! What up? How's it going, boys? How am I feeling? I still, uh, I still got a bit of a of a sinus issue. I, I think I sound a bit sti sick still. I think I sound it, but I feel generally fine. I feel okay. Still, just some lingering effects. I think I'll have a cough for a while though. I think I had acute bronchitis. Self-diagnosed. How you feel about this new Nintendo Smash game? Looks nuts. Yo, what is up, boys? How's it going? Raptor Jack, looking forward to it. What up, what up, what up? Boys, thank you for showing up, soldiers. I'm from Scranton, the office. Notice me. G-Train 17. Scranton is an absolute shit part of Pennsylvania. I've been there. It's trash. The reason they picked it for the office is because it's so not notable as a place in the world. And I can talk shit because they had a New Hampshire office in Nashua. Because no one f should ever care about <laughs> Nashua. You got like a train station. Shows the fit. I'm wearing a Donald Duck sweatshirt that shows off my midriff a bit when I stand up. That's my that's my drip. <clears throat> is what it is. What up, boys? How's it going, chat? No, Tim, damn it. Obviously not. I'm shooting the shit with the boys for a bit. Reading out the beautiful subs that are dripping on in from Extreme Plays and other names. How about now? Tim, it's a third day ban. One more, one more time. Sapphic, thank you very much. Pungulator, thank you for 23 months. What do you need this time? Simple. I need your help for an idea I had. I came across. Now, I've been perusing lately the category of content to make. Post subathon, I haven't really followed a big trend on Twitch in a while. I don't really love GTRP, and that actually seems to be on its way out. And the next trend, I think, is probably going to be IRL streaming. But so far, I don't have that much IRL streams I want to do, and I'm not that comfortable doing it. So I don't really know what to do specifically. So I've been going through the catalogs of content I've created, and I saw that, you know, we've done Amazon streams in the past, and the whole idea is that you guys spend a bunch of my money on dumb shit, and then I open up that dumb shit live on stream, but I thought, what? What's so great about me getting stuck with all this dumb shit? We've done that dozens of times. Do I really need to spend another five, ten thousand dollars for a bunch of random ass trash that I open up once for three hours and then never again? So I had an idea. What? But it's a secret. How did you and Charlie come up with Hive Mind? Been my favorite show for a while. Love you, Lud. We were actually approached face. by Twitch for it. We didn't come up with it. They just they asked uh, me to host, and I said no. And then they asked Charlie to host, and they said he said oh, I think Lud would be a good host. And then I said, well, if Charlie's doing it, I'll do it. And then Hive Mind was born. Okay, but this is a secret chat. Okay, this is a secret. I am making a secret. This is only amongst us. Okay, no Among Us jokes, please, for the love of God. This is amongst us. Because I don't want this to get out to other streamers, okay? Now, for me to begin to explain this, we have to talk about something that's been bothering me for a while. Women. You know how women are just the most supportive humans alive the moment 
they see any other woman who's dressed up or taking a picture, I don't need to regale you with the tales in some relatable stand-up fashion. But I'll, you know, I'll, I'll humor you guys because it is my job. As the Prime subs trickle in, thank you for the Primes. If you have them, I appreciate it. What's the deal with women? <laughs> so, the other day, actually a few weeks ago now, I was in Las Vegas. And at the same time I was in Las Vegas, so was all of offline TV and friends. Great group of people. So lovely. Coincidentally, they were there. All right, and I've already told the story. You've already heard the story, so I don't need to go over it again. It was coincidence. I went separately, not to stock Toast or Saikuno. They went separately. But while I was there, I noticed this phenomenon that I'm sure you've experienced yourself. And this is not exclusive, mind you, to women. A lot of girls already know this feeling. But boys, I think more so than girls, have this. Where girls, the moment the camera's on to take pictures for Insta, become like the most supportive humans alive. They literally change their tune and become one-man cheer squads. Oh my god, yes! 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 Slay! Fuck queen! You are beautiful. No, and then they'll like they'll like express their insecurities. Oh, I feel like my arm's fat. I feel like I just feel like I, I look bloated. No, oh my god, no! If I was in a room with you and Olivia Wilde, and I could fuck one, I would fuck you. <laughs> seriously, seriously. And this doesn't. And this doesn't. This phenomenon. It doesn't translate to men. I have noticed, I don't know if you have this experience, but when a guy take a pic, the entire interaction goes, okay, um, all right, I think one of those is good. And that's it. And that's it. And, and it's not, it's not from a place of maliciousness, I am sure. I don't think men are maliciously trying to hold back their fellow man. I don't think that's how men work. I just think that they're very to the point. They're very direct. They're like, you want a picture? All right, picture taken. Let's move on with our days. But what is the result of this? Well, let's take a look. Let's let's look at a few really big streamers. I mean, I mean let's just take a look right now. For example, at Miskiff. You know, Miskiff, he's got 26,000 viewers. And he's playing video games, so it's rapidly dropping. But these things happen. And let's go over to his link tree. Oh, that's his TikTok. His Instagram. Mizkiff has 163,000 followers on Insta. For comparison, he has 1.5 million on Twitch. That seems to be a discrepancy. Now let's look over at, I don't know, maybe... Who's a good example that will fit nicely? Let's look at Hannah. Hannah, great gamer. Great streamer, a slightly smaller streamer than Mizkip, but let's look at the Insta. Almost as many followers, although about a third as many on Twitch. Now, part of this might just be because Twitch is kind of male-dominated and men are, well, let's just be real, kind of vain, really shallow pieces of shit sometimes, and all they care about is Insta. Um, but I think it's also... Because of the quality of men's content on Instagram. You know what I mean? It feels like if we look through somebody's Insta that's a guy, even if they're a streamer and it's kind of their job, they might post like every week, every other week or something like that. You know, even really hot guys. Let's, let's pull up the hottest man on Twitch. In fact, I'm not even going to pull him up. I'm going to have you guys just say who's the hottest man on Twitch. All right, everybody say it right now who you think the hottest guy on Twitch is. Exact. Okay, well, sure, we'll go to Hassan then. That's fine. No, that's fine. Yeah, so I was looking. Okay, 
So, uh, Hassan, he's good looking, I guess. Hassan Piker, all right, pretty hot guy on Twitch.television. I would assume if you were to take over Hassan's body, you would be really happy with just snapping pics of yourselves left and right. It would be like the live action Scooby Doo movie where Shaggy took over, I, I, I think, Daphne's body. And then started playing around with her her body and her knockers. That's what you would do if you took over Hassan's body. You'd be playing with your giant man pectorials and your likely 30-inch penis. And then taking many, many pictures of yourself because you'd be so profoundly confident in what you look like. It was Fred. Yeah, that makes more sense. While I was saying it, I was like, that's not a homie move of Shaggy to have done. So that makes more sense that it's Fred. Regardless, whoever it is, it doesn't have to be Hassan. If you look up even these giant, beautiful men, their Insta game's kind of weak. I mean, look, July 2nd, all right? Right now we're July 13th. He hasn't posted in almost two weeks. Before that, June 30th, okay? June 10th, 20 days. It's a video, too. June 7th, June 3rd, and it's a fan cam that he definitely didn't make. And even this beautiful man, by the way, I took this picture, and I'll tell you right now, I took about four snaps before I said, all right, it's probably good. Even this beautiful man has a weak-ass Insta. This shit is weak as fuck. Half these pictures are like like terrible selfies or random pictures someone took of him, and he's like, yeah, I guess I'll post that because I haven't posted on Instagram in like 20 days. Even the biggest streamer in the world XQC has 379,000 followers on Insta. Let's just look at another streamer, for example, who at one point was a lot bigger and is now not as... I have more followers than XQC on Insta. I got more than this, bitch. That's crazy. That is crazy. And I'm not good at Instagram, mind you. This is my second to last post. It's a picture of myself shirtless, and I said, time in equals product out. No more excuses. Get up and get at them. I don't get this body overnight. I get it grinding day in, day out with my mind fully focused and my hands on cold iron. And then I did the shh emote. Like I just drained a three. But that's what it's like for a man. And I'm only looking at, this is true, Men whose job it is, whose career depends on relevancy in online social media platforms, literally depends on it. So it's weird that XQC's is so small, a man as hot as Hassan's is so rarely posted on, and, and you know, women of equal size have like way better picks and way more influence. And now I'm not trying to say, I'm not trying to say, hey, let's take over the matriarchy. Okay, that's not my goal. I'm just saying, let's step up our game. So I had this idea. This is all a preamble, okay? This is a preamble because I had, and I check out Tommy and Tubbo. Oh, what? Is this yet another thing that a 17-year-old British kid beats me in? Incredibly influential gamer. This is unfair. Minecraft community doesn't count. Because they post a picture of George doing this. For 400,000 people to like it and go, oh my God, Gogi, oh my God, this is crazy. Like, how is he doing that? And he straight up looks like he took a shit in his pants. Beautiful man, George. Beautiful man. Just saying, sometimes they over-exaggerate it. I swear to God, I see Rambu. Two fucking million likes. Two goddamn million likes. It's not something I really can bring up because it's not something I can really, I can't handle that. I don't, I don't know what to do about it. I can't do that. I can't just be six foot nine, get a million likes doing nothing but just standing with other people in the room. It's not how it works in my life. So I had an idea that I thought would. 
to improve the Instagram game and also more so than just farming influence on social media platforms to gain a bigger following, be a better person and get more dollars from influencers who look at these sites to value you as a human because that's all they do is they take a value based off of our number to say how much we're worth. It's also to feel good. Get a little confidence. Get the same feeling these women do when they do their photo shoots. Yeah, yes, yes, you are beautiful. But with some fellas. But here's the problem. It's not gonna be that easy. I brought up this idea to a lot of the male streamers in LA, right? The Hassans, Will Neffs, Myths. And I said, hey, let's, let's do a photo shoot, boys. Let's do a photo shoot with all of us and get a professional photographer, get a set location. They were all, they were like hype on the idea. They're like, yeah, 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 yeah. But I think the problem is when we actually get there, everyone's going to be like a little, it's going to be like shy because it seems as though because of maybe how men are supposed to be in society versus women, they have a little bit of a harder time genuinely right? Genuinely trying to put in an effort into looking good in the vanity that comes with taking pictures. And so what solves that issue? Irony. Irony solves that issue. Jokes, memes, deflections from genuine assertions of beauty. Because if you make a sexy face, but if you have a shirt that says, come in me at the same time, it, 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 it equals out. It balances out. It's how I'm able to post on my Instagram so often because I can go from posting, you know, an actual genuine selfie with Tina and then to balance it out, I post a picture of me doing something stupid. It's how we get away with it. So that's where you come in, boys. Today, boys. The plan is simple. You need to find me the greatest, funniest, memeiest, shittiest shirts on Amazon.com for me and my friends to wear in a photo shoot in conjunction with some normal outfits so we can break the ice and start bumping up our Instagram game and our comfortability taking pictures. It's an Amazon stream with a twist because today, boys, I want only shirts only really upper wear clothing it may be some sillier costumes but generally just some shirts for me and the boys to wear in a pro photo shoot make sense that's why i need your help today it's gonna be a 45 minute youtube video because there's a 20 minute intro on it <laughs> Have we done this before? Yes, 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 yes. Now you might be thinking, Ludwig, don't you have a giant wardrobe of shirts like this? And the answer is, well, kind of. Uh, I have a few shirts that still remain, but I also have a girlfriend who will go through my closet and be like, bro, this says thanks to my mommy milky girlfriend for bringing me to my dinner today. Can you get rid of this shirt? I don't want you to wear it in public. Or she'll just literally steal my shirt that says come on me. Or I'll give it to Slime, and it'll be a shirt that says, I took a shit in a Lowe's, and he'll peepo pog off, and then take it. Or, uh, it's just never been a main objective. You know what I mean? We have done this before, but it has always been a side dish. It's always been the mashed potatoes, but today I want it to be the steak. Do you know what I mean? I want it to be the focus. And it's not just for me either, all right? So we'll need mediums, we'll need larges, we'll need extra larges, we'll need different sizes, we'll need different variables, variances, okay? And the people that I think I'd want to do this for, at the very least, would be like me, Will, Hassan, Myth, maybe Miz, maybe Connor, depends if they're in town, maybe uh, people of that, that group. I think that's the idea. Um, so, yeah, maybe Austin if he's in town. Basically, just LA people. And then T 
Tubbo and Tommy in it and Rambo just so that we can just farm some likes, actually. <laughs> you know what would get a million likes on Twitter? You just get every Minecraft kid and you have them stand sequentially in height. While wearing shirts that have the, the pride flag. <gasps> on June 1st at midnight. Yeah. Caption, gay people, pog champ. <laughs> and then deleted on July 1st. You're my mans. All right. Let's get to it, boys. We got no time to waste because I still have to record the podcast tonight. Uh, episode two of The Yard, which will be coming out Thursday. Uh, so let's let's jump to, let's hop to. You're going to link it in this chat, all right? Now, a few rules, a few rules. Before we get the links ready, I want you guys to spend this time really trying to explore and find what would be a good t-shirt. But but let's follow a few things. First of all, let's make sure that these shirts are uh, a, a following terms of service. You know, I, I don't want anything hateful, even if you're just doing it as a joke or anything just in, incredibly like like rude or something like that, obviously. You know what I mean? Uh, two, I uh, make sure that the shirt is on amazon.com U S version. A lot of the times you guys will link me dot UK dot, dot Canada. Uh, and, and I can't use that stuff. I just genuinely can't, uh, three also, it doesn't have to be Amazon prime per se, but make sure it ships in a reasonable time. Cause sometimes you guys be linking me shit and it's like, Hey, this will get here in September 7th. And it's, and it's like, bro, I'm trying to do this photo shoot. Like I want to, you know. We got to get this comment. We're daily uploaders in this bitch. I can't wait two months to do a goddamn YouTube video because I'm waiting for an Amazon package to arrive, you know? Uh, and, and that's it. And that's it. Uh, and, and I'm not going to veto anything today. Uh, we're just going to say let's do uh, 20 t-shirts. That's our number. Once we hit 20 t-shirts, it's done. No matter what. You guys will get to vote on it or maybe we'll just play it a little more by ear. We'll see either way. I'm not too stressed out about that voting aspect, uh, but I won't veto anything. It'll more so just be like looking at it, seeing if it's funny, probably voting on it. And if it passes, we'll take it, but probably 20 max, 20 max. Uh, anyway, without further ado, I'm going to turn on the links in a few moments. Bear with me. Bear with me. Are you bearing? Please bear with me. All right. It has been done. It'll take about 45 seconds to a minute to kick in, uh, which is the perfect allotted amount of time to ask you guys. Boys, how's it going? Ludwig here. Have you recently checked to see if you have a Twitch Prime available? This is genuinely the number one thing you can do as one of my viewers to help support. It's absolutely free if you already have Amazon Prime and in fact not using it will lose you money all you gotta do is click the subscribe button scroll down and see if it says subscribe free and purple on your favorite channel it doesn't have to be me but if you got one th then use it that's it just straight up use it if you're already primed to someone else that's fine at least click the button so you can see which date it becomes available next and I'll try to thank as many of you guys here because um, maybe that makes you feel better when I say your name uh, for giving me something in return, which is fair. I won't judge you for that, so I, I'll say your name. Uh, but I really do appreciate if you guys, at the very least, check. And if you use it on me, thank you a lot. You're super nice. Now let's get to it. We got some shirts to click on. Uh, John Cube, thank you the Prime. Okay, a lot of women's clothing I'm seeing off rip. I didn't I think the whole preamble was that this is generally for. Uh, try to keep it to Amazon, boys. Seeing some non Amazon items, which can be fun, but. I guess I'm not opposed to it, but it's just easier. Because some of these just take so long to arrive. Yeah. 
Okay, that's fun. That's a fun one. Some of these are fun. <laughs> okay, all right, all right, all right, all right. If you can tell, I'm, I'm still a little bit, little bit sick. We're on the, the back half, though. Second half, Andy. Okay, some of you guys are just linking actual shirts that are like... Alright! I'm going to turn off the links for round one, boys. Again, we're, we're looking for about 20 shirts here today. Is this following terms of service? I don't know if this follows terms of serv service. Uh, <laughs> follows terms of service. I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna describe this shirt and how it looks, and you guys tell me if this follows the TOS. Okay. I'm gonna put it on emote only. Do the yay if you think it follows TOS. Do the nay if it doesn't follow the TOS. And then I'm, I'm gonna read it out. Uh, <clears throat> It is a Christmas-themed long sleeve t-shirt where the bottom part is meant to look like an elf costume, yet the arms in the top half are meant to resemble skin. And it just so happens that the skin are two giant knockers with ornaments hung up blocking the nipples of the knockers. Um... I'm I'm fifty fifty. Is it? I don't know if that's a. Can I? Can you have pasties? You're my man's. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nay, 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 nay. Look, it, I will say it is themed very accurately towards... Okay, I got a couple .co.uk's. It's themed very accurately towards Christmas. I don't feel bad cutting it. So I'm just going to cut it. I'm just going to safely cut it. I think that's safe. That's just easy. Just making sure none of these break terms of service so I don't get banned. All right. I think we are about ready. Now, very simply, we're going to just go through these. You guys are going to vote, and we're going to see if, you, we, if we like them, if we don't like them, yada, yada, yada. Sound good? All right, chat. This is all on you. Emote only off. We'll do another round, so if you guys want to continue. No more links right now, but if you guys want to take your time. To go look up some shirts in the meantime, you can. Just don't paste them in chat because uh, it's not going to work um, until I open it up again. Make sense? Uh, all right. Let's get to it. Our first shirt is... You're my man's. <sighs> the Earth is flat. Vaccines are for depopulation. The moon landing was faked. Chemtrails are geoengineering. Global warming is a hoax. Stand up against scientism. And if we scroll down to some of the reviews, we have Lisa who says, love my new shirt. And that's it. That's all Lisa said. She just, she loves it. Let's see if there's any more reviews here. Nope, just Lisa. Just Lisa, it looks like. Okay. Uh, what, do we th what do we think about this? What do we think about this shirt? Do we like it? Do we hate it? So we'll do a quick little vote here on, on Lisa's favorite new shirt. It almost feels too earnest to be ironic. It feels like someone just made it. Like, I imagine this is ironic, obviously. But it feels almost like... But I guess scientism's not a thing. 
So obviously it's a meme. All right, it's a no. We're going to pass. Again, we're looking for about 20 shirts next. That guy, funny, I'm that guy, dude, gift idea shirt. And it's just a shirt that says that guy. I'm that guy. And people often buy it in conjunction with victory is mine, Stewie Griffin t-shirt. Okay, now it feels like we have just gotten access to a Redditor's wardrobe. This no longer feels like a meme shirt. And this is just like... What's an American hikikimori? Is that just what a Redditor is? <laughs> Are they the same thing? All right, a lot of twos, a lot of twos. Fair enough, fair enough. We're being a bit stingier on these. Let's let's slide over to the next. Surely this one will tickle your fancy. Shit, shit. All right. Ask me about my ninja flip-up shirt. Now, these, these are a bit of a unique shirt, flip-up shirts. They're good in some ways, bad in some others. The good thing is it shows off the body. The bad thing is it just hides the human behind it. But in a group picture, I could see it being like a good thing. You know what I mean? Like as a solo pick, it doesn't make a lot of sense because you can just post really anything, but... Not in stock? Well, we can find one. This shirt's not... We'll find it. If you guys vote yes, I'll, 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 make, I'll make it happen. All right? Trust. I'll make it happen. Cowgirls make do. That's what you guys gotta know about me. All right. Let's add it up. Uh, let me... Start counting the amount of shirts we have. Is it such a thin? Boom. All right, next. I'll just drag it over here to keep it. I paused my hentai to be here. Okay. So... Sorry, I'm sorry. It feels like you guys are a bit confused. The idea behind these is that these were meme shirts. We're not actually trying to find shirts that Will Neff probably wears in private. You guys know what I mean? No, not me. I would not wear this, obviously. Do not turn this on me. Do not turn this on me. I don't even know what a Do Jin Shu is. Do Jin Chi? I'm not, I, see? I don't know. I'm not knowledgeable about these things. I will say, Will Neff's the first person that popped in my mind because uh, there's a TV show, <laughs> TV show, there's an anime called Welcome to the NHK, which is about like a hikikimori, which is just a, a shut-in, someone who lives alone and doesn't exit their home. And uh, in about, I've only watched like a third, about half the entire show so far has been about jerking off to hentai. And Will said, and I quote, it's like his favorite anime of all time. And he even prefaced before I watched it, he's like, it's a bit of like, it's a bit of a horny one. And I was like, okay, yeah, sure, sure, sure. A bit was a little an, uh, of an understatement, okay? This is, <laughs> he basically just linked me porn and then went, yeah, there's some dicks and vaginas. It's mostly about the plot here though. <laughs> uh, all right, let's get it. Let's get it. We'll cop it, add to cart. Uh, I'll have to figure out the sizes because I want a good vary uh, variance. Uh, but we'll add it. Next shirt is... They're called neats. No, isn't that different? Because you can be a neat and a hikikimori because a neat is just not educated or it's not in education or employment or training. But it doesn't necessarily mean that you're a shut-in. You can be a sociable neat. I think they're related, but they're not the same. Anyway, besides that, let's get naked. And it's a banana who takes off his peel. And obviously, when we think about peeling off 
So, you know, you think about peeling off a banana, right? <laughs> you know, and, and you're removing its peel to eat it, but you don't think if the banana was alive that you, you would be removing its, its skin, its clothes. So it'd be a naked banana, right? You know, and it, this would be like when, when Eve bit the apple, all right? The innocence removed because, you know, okay, a lot of twos flying out. We're just not even going to go to a vote. We'll just go next. We'll go next. Uh, why do I get the feeling that Soda Poppins worn this? Am I making that up in my head? I feel like he's worn this. Is that just bullying? I feel like Soda Poppin has 100% worn this and went, Rawr! and it seemed to fit him. I feel like if Chance Morris didn't become a wildly successful streamer who gets like multi-thousand dollar sweaters from Twitch, he would be wearing a Hyrule green t-shirt with a Triforce and cargo shorts. <laughs> Mostly because that's what NMP still wears. <laughs> he would just have to go to Nick's closet to find it. All right, a lot of twos. We don't like the dino. We did like the ninja. That's fair. Next, all I need is a little bit of coffee, a whole lot of Jesus, and a few more chickens. And it has one rating, but it's two stars. What happened? What happened to the person who received this? How would you rate this two stars? There's no... The product you are ordering... Unless the shirt quality is just terrible. Funny Christian shirt gift for women men. What Roman Catholic or Mormon or whoever got this shirt and was like, Fuck. I thought this shirt was unironic. <laughs> that I got made fun of every time I wore it. I don't know what went wrong. Two stars. We can balance it out. One five-star review and this shit's booming again. Over halfway. We like this. Okay. All I need is a little bit of coffee, a whole lot of Jesus, and a few more chickens. Cold beer on a Friday night. A pair of jeans will fit just right. We'll get it next. Uh, we'll just cop a large for now. Uh, area 69. I'm sorry for ever talking shit on you guys. I'm sorry. Can I apologize? Because when, when I ask you guys to come out here and give me good shirts, I, I wasn't going to lie. I was expecting some trash. I was ex maybe expecting some dumb jokes. Is this weird of me to say? But you come out here with comedy incarnate? I apologize. I didn't realize when Andy Kaufman died, his soul went to my Twitch chat. This is hilarious. This is, this is hilarious. I'm sorry. This is literally the funniest thing I've ever seen. Congratulations, Twitch chat. You've done it again. Thank you, Lord Sethrin, for the three months. If you guys don't go to class, well, I guess it's summer, to work tomorrow, tell your boss about this, or buy it yourself, really. This might just be my new merch. Uh, let's get it a large that's three down. Three down, and we are cruising. Next shirt. I'm so good with my rod. <laughs> That's funny. I, I do love some good fish and some good 
PPNUN does. And this one even has a trailer? What are you, a Silicon Valley startup? Okay, hold up, I got this. So I was out one day on my boat, and I was thinking to myself, man, do I love fishing? But in the same moment, I was also thinking about boobs. And that's when I realized that I don't only make women come, I make fish come. And our company was born. <laughs> uh, yeah, this is beautiful. I don't even need to do a vote. There's no point in voting for this. This is like the 2020 elections. It's not close. We just get this. We just cop this instantly. Meme shirt jellyfish looks like penis. You looked up meme shirt jellyfish that looks like penis and you ended up with this? <laughs> Wait, these shirts are fire. This is the best... You have found the forbidden combination of words. Look at these shirts, all right? First of all, we have, I think this is like a Tifu emote. I don't really know where this is from. I'm pretty sure this is a character in a new uh, fighting game. I don't know where that's from either. This shirt, fire. My perfect day, wake up, play video games, eat breakfast, play video games, eat lunch, play video games, eat dinner. Uh-oh, play video games, then sleep. Mine's so big, I have to use two hands. Thou shall not try me. Mood 24-7. That is so true. I do love this shirt. I'm pretty sure we bought this shirt for Atrioc once upon a time. The Never Forget shirt. Do you guys remember that one? I think he lost Monkey Ball and it's such a boomer shirt. Well, that's not a good sign. That's like a Newgrounds shirt. All right, hold up. I, I think... I don't want to give these guys too much publicity, but I think this, this crazy dog company is on to something. Let's look through Crazy Dog. They got some funny shirts. Are these guys some funny people? Are these some funny folks? Oh, they do the ninja shirt. Oh my God. Riot. Why is this funny? What is this? <laughs> what is this? How is this one funny? <laughs> it's from Oh Sunny. Okay. Ask me about my ninja disguise. Oh, and then you flip it. Oh, the ninja one's a two-parter? Ask me about my ninja disguise, and then you show it. Wow. Holy shit. M. Night Shyamalan the shirt. That is insane. A better ending than Code Geass? Prestige Worldwide. Okay, that's just a lame reference. You can't scare me. I have a daughter. Okay. I'm in a fitness, fitness boob. In <laughs> a baby shirt? Talking about sucking titties? That's pretty funny. Am I getting old or is that funny? I might just be getting old and then shitty dad humor is funny to me now. I can't tell. Maybe I'm just losing my sense of humor. But making a baby infant who doesn't know how to communicate with the rest of the world... Talk about sucking titties is kind of funny. Creeper. I'm into fitness. <laughs> Why are you trying to make babies creepy? Uh, they make the T-Rex one. Don't be a dumb bass. Oh, puns. Okay, that's whatever. If you think I'm cute, you should see my aunt. That seems problematic for the family. Mine's so big I have to use two hands. That's pretty fire. Uh, world's tallest leprechaun. Okay, that feels racist. I don't have the time or the crayons to explain this to you. I don't even get that. Red, white, bruise. They're like tangoing this line of just the cringiest normie shirts ever to somewhat humorous shirts. These all feel like shirts if I gave them to my stepdad for Christmas 
his reaction every time would just be to laugh and then be like, this is great. Look at this, honey. <laughs> Which maybe is what you want in a dumb meme shirt. Is that what the line is? Is a dumb meme shirt just basically what your stepfather would want? I came from... <laughs> wow. They're really crass around babies. Don't call... Don't make me call my auntie. Proud husband of a freaking awesome wife. Okay, that just seems regular. Uh, Yeah, all these seem pretty good. Hulk mode on. This shirt's actually really funny. I don't think they intended this to be funny, but I like the idea of a really... Like, if Connor Eats Pants was wearing this shirt, it'd be really funny. You guys see the vision? You see the vision of Connor Eats Pants wearing this shirt? I could imagine Connor wearing this shirt and then being like, get it? Because if the meter goes the the full way, I'm gonna become the Incredible Hulk. It's my Connor impression. It's like a, like four percent more nasally. Chat, don't make me turn on Hulk mode, guys. Stop, stop, guys. Stop talking about Pokemon. I'm gonna go Hulk mode. We should, we should. All right, let's do a vote on that one. Do we, do we get this one for maybe Connor eats pants? That could be apt. Yes, 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 yes. All right, I'm down. Uh, what the fuck size is Connor? I don't want to do my man dirty. Is he a medium? He's probably a medium, right? Medium sounds apt for Connor. Uh, all right, I think the rest of these... are kind of mid. It's getting worse, I think. I do love fishing shirts, though. Uh, so I think the only other one is this one. I think we're going to get this one as well. Let's cop these two. Let's cop these two, call it a day. And that puts us at five. They have a lot of fitness jokes. Meowica instead of America. It's too basic. It's a little too basic. Like, someone actually might wear this. Lubricate my AR-50. <laughs> That's the greatest shirt ever. Hassan in this shirt. Lubricate my AR-15 in that shitty K-Kona voice he does. Yeah, lubricate my AR-15 with that liberal cum. <laughs> That's a great shirt. That's a phenomenal shirt. Is it funnier if it's purple? Is there, or is it funnier if it's black? I can't tell. Red? Yeah, red might be good. A little color on there. I wish they had pink. But they don't have it. Army green. I kind of like army green. I'm going to go with olive. What size is his on? Is he an XL? He probably is, right? Because he's just so fucking huge. He's a double XL? Isn't it funny how crazy the relationship between viewer and streamer is? That there's like 30 people in my chat who immediately know how big Hassan is and what his shirt size is. Ask yourselves right now if you know the shirt size of every immediate family member. Ask yourselves that. Everyone who told me Hassan's shirt size, tell me your mom, your dad, and your sibling's shirt size. Do you know the answer? I don't know it off rip. I also don't know Hassan's though, so. Uh, yeah, let's get it. Double XL. Lubricate my AR-15 with liberal cum. Because <laughs> it's so big. It's why what is liberal come is it just like more more viscous? 
is liberal come they have like little baby viscous come well not baby that's a weird thing but like <laughs> I think I found the problem my head was up my ass what is this video why are you looking at me like that what is this? The Ann Arbor T-Shirt Company is a screen print and embroidery shop located in Ann Arbor, Michigan, about 40 miles west of Detroit. We started in a dorm room at the University of Michigan in 2008 and have been adding friends ever since. In 2018, we retrofitted an 80-year-old machine shop into a cutting-edge print and sew facility where we bring art to life for customers all over the world. Art. <laughs> we use top-of-the-line M&R presses, manufactured in Illinois, to allow our skilled printers to work extremely efficiently. That lets us keep costs low without compromising quality, which means we can sell good stuff at a reasonable price. We train and keep good people with an internal apprentice program, provide 401k matches, catered lunches, and health care. We think it's the right thing to do anyway, and as a bonus, it turns out that happy people make better apparel. We take a ton of pride in making good shirts with some great people. If you ever find yourself in our corner in Michigan, please stop by for a tour. That was a very cute commercial. That felt like a commercial from The Office if Michael Scott didn't work there. That was like an actual, like, wholesome, small business commercial. All right, let's visit their store. Let's see if they have some funny stuff. Oh my fucking God. These are just categories of shirts? You have an entire category for mechanic and fix-it shirts? Real cars don't shift themselves. I void warranties. And then the Prindle, or no, just a, a manual. My therapist is a wrench. That's so true. I actually feel that. <laughs> what are you pussies actually doing therapy these days? What are you viscous having liberal cummers <laughs> talking to another human about your emotions, you pussies? It's called getting on your knees using a wrench. Okay? Okay. I get on my knees and I bow down to my car. Righty tighty lefty loosey. And I'm always hard as fuck when I'm fixing my car. Saw, sawdust is man glitter. Of course I talk to myself. Sometimes I need expert advice. <laughs> Why is that for mechanics? This is like mechanics and also condescending <laughs> narcissistic douchers. Both. Duct tape. It can't fix stupid, but it can muffle the sound. <laughs> wow. Wow, 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 wow. All right. Let's look through the recommended. Sarcastic comment loading. Please wait. It's not bad. Breaking news. I don't care. Okay. So well, I feel like one of these could be good. This is a great shirt. Reagan Bush 1984. It's great if it was ironic, but it's actually just like, why would you buy this? A Reagan Bush 84? They're both dead. They're literally both dead. That's crazy. What a crazy shirt to have. Schlatt has this shirt. Are you serious? Schlatt has this shirt. I wish they had older ones. I want like a politics shirt, like a presidential candidacy shirt from like the 1836. Taft and like Gerber babies or whatever the fuck the VP was then.
Uh, yeah, I think we'll pass. Do we want this one? Do we want this one, chat? What do we feel about this one? Nah, all right. A radiation shield for health and safety and UV protection. What? $186? It works. I'm a 70-year-old... Dude, this is for like... <laughs> what are you doing? I know you're just trying to get me to spend a shit ton of money because it's an Amazon stream and you could link anything. But there's this like sweet old man. I'm a 73-year-old male that suffers from the effects of EMF. I sense it most when I'm driving a vehicle or I'm inside of a building laden with fluorescent lights. It's like this poor 73-year-old man that just figured out Amazon. Mostly because 70-year-old men are the only people that actually do Amazon write-ups. Is this shirt a scam? Radiation shield. This Is this like what is in the box of like an anti-vaxxer's closet? This is like 5G Shungite. That's crazy. What a fucking scam. It's 100% nylon. Dude, this is like a $5 shirt they're selling for 185 because it kind of looks like it's made of aluminum foil. That's crazy. That's terrible. Oh my God. Holy shit. How is this legal? How are you able to sell this for 185 Good marketing? Yeah. So is when doctors told you to smoke a cigarette for your health problems. It was good marketing. <laughs> it's also not very moral or ethical, you know? Sometimes there's a line you got to draw. Uh, My Little Pony Friendship is Magic t-shirt. My Little Pony is making fun of My Little Pony humorous is this still a humor thing are we are we giggling at this love it the print job's not perfect but still a good shirt my little pony i feel like it's a little too on the nose you know what i mean it's a little too a little too if lifting was easy it would be called your mom wow and it's the Ann Arbor T-shirt company. Wow. That's fire. This is just a great shirt. It was a gift for my 6'3 brother. He loves it. I got this joke gift for my boyfriend who loves to work out. He got a laugh out of it. Good quality. All right, yeah, let's cop. That's a great shirt. I'm the psychotic dentist mom everyone <laughs> warned you about. Oh, my God. And then the red letters read, I'm the hot dentist mom. Dude, psychotic dentist moms. They don't stop ruining PTA meetings. <laughs> this is a great shirt. What the fuck is a psychotic dentist mom? What's a dentist mom? <laughs> I've never heard of that. I've never even heard of that before until now. That's never, I've never even thought that phrase. Dentist mom. Are they a dentist that's a mother? Are they a mother that goes to a dentist a lot? Are they the mother of a dentist? I don't know. I don't know. And I don't want to know. I kind of like the mystery. Yeah, I'll be the first person to buy this shirt. This shirt's great. This is a good shirt. May I suggest the sausage? <laughs> this is like the shirt that people would unironically wear in like 2012 YouTube prank videos. This is like what Logan Paul would wear when he did man on street interviews. And he'd like lasso a girl and he'd be like, and then he'd reveal the shirt and being like, you want to suck my dick? <laughs> and then laugh at the camera. <laughs> Yeah, this is Sam Pepper on the beat for sure. <laughs> uh, what do we think? What do we think?
thank you very much pam for the 16 months guys i see a few people donating uh t-shirt links but try not to donate links boys um just because uh then it'll be dono only and i and i like to just kind of make it a chat thing it's more fun you know than just being like hey who's got fucking fat stacks all right let's get it oh what the fuck uh let's get it in like a light blue we need some color I work harder than an ugly stripper. Look, I gotta support my sex workers on this one. They're working too damn hard. <sighs> um... Bay mom, I will miss you while I am at college. The school where I will learn to become a worm might even get worm doctorate w well by. What the fuck is this? What is this shirt? I, this is like a mumble. I can't tell if it's trying to do that thing that I hate where they like, you know how there's like a cute baby golden and then they'll like talk for the golden or if it's just like, you know, ironic meme. It's like doggo. It has 10k reviews. It's probably the actual shirt has 10k reviews. We'll pass, we'll pass, we'll pass. Commit tax fraud. And it has Barney. <laughs> That's pretty fire. That's pretty fire. Commit tax fraud? I think we got a cop. You got a cop a commit tax fraud with Barney on it. All right, we're about to enter the second round of voting, or excuse me, uh, of links. I'll open up these links to non-Amazon. Non it's not right now, but uh, I'll open up to non-Amazon uh, if you guys want. But make them like regular sites, like a Redbubble or a Teespring. If you link me a site that I've never heard of that doesn't have HTTPS protocol, I just won't click the link. Uh, we are currently at eight. I never dreamed I'd grow up to be super cool wife of a freaking awesome welder, but here I am killing it. Yeah. Welder wives. Fair enough, bad dog. All right, no one likes that. Last one, it's just Pog Champ. And it says Pog Champ. And it has the image that's Pog Champ above it. Very simple to the point shirt. Thank you, Joe, for the host, brother. Appreciate that. Uh, appreciate that, man. Hope you had a good uh, stream. All right, that's a very tight vote, but I think it is a no. And boys, I'm going to open up links again. It can be to anything. I think for this one, just because it can be to anything, I might make it sub only. I'm a little nervous. I'm a little nervous. Um... Just for the link period, I'll, I'll I'll open it up after. Sorry, non subs, but it, it's it uh, it can be a, like a link to any website now instead of just Amazon, which makes me a little more. All right, opening it up. If you do have a Prime, you could Prime and then spam your link. That is true. Yes, that is true. Indubitable. I wouldn't spend five dollars. Probably not worth that. Because realistically, I I probably won't click your link out of the hundreds of links that'll be sent my way. But if you got a Prime, sure. All right, they're out.
Keep them coming, boys! Okay, keep them going. I got to remove some of these. Jesus, you can't just link me anime titties. Some of you guys are so deep into the ironic shirts that I can't tell what's ironic anymore. Alright, voting's done! Welcome back, boys! I uh, just gotta remove a few of these. Couple repeats. Couple not following TOSs. Okay. All right, boys. We got a few more shirts. Let's take a look at them. It starts with not a shirt, mind you. This isn't even a shirt. Someone just linked this, and I want to know why it exists and why it already has reviews. What the fuck?
single? No. Taken? No. Mentally dating Ludwig Ogren. Five star reviews. And then, also available, shirt form. Also available, Luddy A, my first run. I voted Mogul Moves. The plan is so simple. Mogul Moves. Ludwig Minecraft skin. What is... What is this? This t-shirt's kind of funny. I don't know why it exists. All right, do we buy it before I sue them for all they're worth? Let me know, boys. It's a yes, let's cop it. Next. You can't buy happiness, but you can buy a hot tub. That's pretty much the same thing. There was like seven hot tub shirts that people linked me. And so I, I, I left this one. I, I don't know what the, I don't know if this is because it's the Twitch meme still, but what do we think? Kind of lame. All right. Yeah, we'll skip it. We'll skip it. A little outdated. Mommy Milker's on board. It's kind of fire. <laughs> I don't know who wears this, but it's kind of fire. I don't know who's got the mommy milkers on board. But you got to respect it at some point. People like the mommy milkers. All right. All right. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. Next. Uh, One Piece Nami shirt. And it's just Nami from One Piece on a t-shirt. And it, the both sides are the same thing. What do you think? What's fucked up is I feel like Hassan would wear this with like, uh, you know, a shoulder strap bag and like shorts that look like they're straight out of a, a cartoon. And have like the best drip in the room. All right, let's cop. Oh, wait, you guys voted no. All right, I'll delete it. Next. The male lady is in the ditch again. This has gone beyond irony. We have moved over to absurdism. This is a great shirt. Stelio, thank you for the 34 months. Etwan, thank you for the uh, 20. Twick, thank you for the 21. The male ladies in the ditch again. That's a fire shirt. I don't get it. No one does. It's more so that you can express anything you want on a shirt. Next. Infinite Obama t-shirt. He was one hell of a golfer. May he rest. And then it's just infinitely Obama pointing at Obama. People are a fan of the Obama shirt. All right, let's run it. Ew, people, rainbow unicorn t-shirt, girls, kids, reviews. <clears throat> 
The shirts are thin, but okay in Texas weather. Just won't put them in the dryer. Love this shirt. It goes perfect with my mask. I love it. Way too small. People unironically wear this is what it sounds like. It sounds like people unironically find this shirt and go, all right, look at the search term. Ludwin is not funny. So brave, so bold for a Ludwig viewer to say that. Uh, okay, D again, we've already bought this one. I think I still own it, so we're not going to buy it again. But I can't believe it's still on Amazon. I can't believe it's still on Amazon. I'm not a player. I'm a gamer. Players get chicks. I get bullied. <coughs> I get bullied. <coughs> I get bullied at school. I forget why. I, I think I saw this on Twitter for some reason. I don't even know why I saw it on Twitter, but I did. Yeah, it's a fire shirt, dude. <laughs> That's just a great shirt. It's also just a great picture of Sonic. Get it for Connor. Isn't it funny that half these shirts you see and they're just like ridiculous, stupid uh, graphic tees. And the first person you think of is Connor Reed's pants. The shirt can literally be like, I want to come in a fish's mouth. And you'd be like, dude, that's a classic Connor moment. That is a classic Connor moment. Yes. Yes. That is so Connor. <laughs> uh, cat riding shark shirt. See, this would be cool. If it doesn't feel like something Elon Musk would wear, take a picture of, and then post on Twitter with a thumb up, and then get 2 million likes. With the caption, I watch anime. If that wasn't the reality, may maybe it's a little better. Maybe it flies a little more. This is my Ludwig costume, and it's a picture of Ludwig von Koopa with his arms crossed begrudgingly, but also sinisterly. <laughs> Lol, Ludwig short. All right, can you stop using the shirt term. Short, sh 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 fuck. Stop. Ah, shit. 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 I meant to say search term. I said short. Stop. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. I can speak. It was not a, it was not a Freudian slip. I'm sick. <coughs> and I'm just a bit under the weather, which requires me and causes me to have some mishaps in my in my speech. I'm trilingual chat. What well, languages? Uh, English, French, and ad reads. Speaking of, boys, if you guys haven't already, do me a quick favor. Under the subscribe button, it says subscribe free in purple. And a lot of you guys might have a Twitch Prime available right now. All I ask that you do is you just take the next few moments to scroll down and take a look. If you're watching on YouTube, might as well hit the subscribe button while you're here, huh? Stick around a while. Just going to hold it here till you do it. Could be a while. Hopefully you do it soon. Yeah, that's right, bitches. I use you for my setups. Without pay. Next. You're my man. Uh, we'll add this one to the cart, though. Uh, which puts us at 12, uh, I believe.
This guy plays Super Smash Bros for Wii U. That that's true. That is so true. That might be the least played Smash game right now. Is that crazy to say? I think that's the least played Smash game out of all of them. Which is weird because it's the second most recent. I'm including the 3DS one in the bundle, but... Actually, the 3DS one might be more played because a lot of people might be just fucking broke and can only afford the 3DS. I think Brawl might have more players. No cap. Uh, it's a no. Next. Oh, we got that one. Blow me. <laughs> it is just a 50th birthday t-shirt. Ann Arbor again. These sons of bitches. Atrioc, you get him in the photo shoot and just have him wear a shirt that says blow me. Oh, wait, Atrioc? Uh, okay, sorry. Uh, all right. Nice shirt. Let's go next. I'm too cool to wear one of those stupid shirts with a funny saying on it. Self-aware. Mm, yes, yes. This this has the same energy as one of those shirts that's like, did you know that you spent the entire time reading this shirt and wasted all of your like effort? You know those stupid shirts that are like, I made you read this shirt, shirts. For some reason, I would have family members get me those shitty shirts as a kid. And then I don't know what it was, but growing up, I would get just random people in my life give me like the new shirt, like a sweatshirt with a built-in headphone or like a hidden phone charger or like a t-shirt where you can secretly hide something in a pocket just like weird new invention shirts and i was always like why 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 do we need this gadget shirts yeah basically like tech wear but without being cool <laughs> uh band nerd band nerd shirt nerdy band t-shirt band camp geek tee I mean, I guess we can get another one. I already have like three of these. You want me to cop another one? This is basically my wardrobe at the moment. I just scroll through 50 navies, 50 blacks. My entire wardrobe, like Steve Jobs. The man, and it's the face. The legend, and it's the... Mm, as worn by Nathan... From Nathan for you, Nathan Fielder. That is a great shirt for Nathan Fielder. Who's the best streamer to wear this shirt? Like Jerma. If I could make Jerma wear this shirt. <laughs> Connor, yeah. Shroud would be very funny. Soda, yeah. Mango? Mango, if he wears it, you would just start talking about his fucking massive penis for 13 minutes. Saikudo? He would never. All right, yeah, let's go. This is a good one. I have PTSD. Pretty tired of stupid Democrats. Okay, I had to like X out because you guys sent me like 30 Republican shirts. You sent me so many Republican shirts. Is this ironic or is this unironic? Let's look at the reviews. Trump lost, LOL. <laughs> look at the salty lib. The salty lib who can't face the truth that Trump is coming back. All right, it's coming home actually means Trump is coming home July 16th. 
And if not, then we'll pick another day that he comes back. <laughs> oh, fuck. What's up, bitch? Look at this shit. We're buying funny t-shirts. PTSD, pretty tired of stupid Democrats. That's really funny because it's like mocking veterans while also being mad at Democrats, even though, like, you should be. It's like one or the other, right? Uh huh. Yeah. What a crazy shirt. Yeah. That's crazy. Hey, I'm sorry to interrupt. I'm sorry to interrupt you. All right. But I feel like we had a prior engagement. <sighs> Did we? Look at our DMs. You and me. Look at the ball gag. Oh, I did reply. Oh, it is. All right, yeah. Give me 10. All right. <clears throat> Thank you, the five gifted Rachel. Appreciate that. Top gifter, Pog you. Yeah, we got to record the yard. Uh, are we copping this one? I didn't realize time flew. I was planning on doing a pretty short stream. No. Yes. Yes, no. No, yes. No. Mostly no's. I think the liberal cum one's funny. I am not a gynecologist, but I'll have a damn good look. And it's for some reason over like this weird back of solid black and white. <laughs> this is a terrible shirt. I This is the shirt that I would feel the most uncomfortable wearing in public, but it would be kind of funny to wear for a photo shoot. You know what I mean? I hate it, but it's kind of funny to wear for a photo shoot. It would just be like the worst shirt ever. All right, let's cop it. I shaved my balls for this. And it looks like the one from, uh, what's the shit? That one movie. Pedro for president. Napoleon Dynamite. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do we cop? I shaved my balls for this. Let's get it. Uh, okay. Chat, we don't have that much time. So we're going to do our first ever. I have everything that I didn't get uh, over. Oh, wait. Did I add the Sonic one to the list? Maybe I didn't. But I want to get about five more shirts. So we're going to do a rapid fire round, okay? I'm going to open it up. We're going to do a very rapid fire round. You guys link. And I'm going to make the call. I'm just going to click like 20 links. And I'm just going to make executive decisions based off them. Then the plan after this. Is to set up the photo shoot. Do some behind the scenes shooting. Get a YouTube video with this being the first part. And then the second part being the actual photo shoot for it. Make sense? Links are not open just yet. They'll be open in a little bit. Thank you for the subs, though. Chris, Kyopu's, Umari, and Mirror Weaving. Sorry about the short stream today, boys. I had to do a, a shoot earlier today, like a film shoot for um, Beyond the Summit, for uh, for Smash Summit, which will you guys will see. It'll be pretty funny. And then uh, I also have uh, the pod. Uh, but tomorrow should be the first like good ass stream back in a while, and also Hive Mind. Which has changed to 6 p.m. by the way. I'll still probably go live around noon, but Hive Mind won't be at noon. It'll be at 6 p.m. tomorrow. Uh, they changed it back because they did some numbers and they say the viewership's better for the show. Oh, I was like, all right, whatever. Rapid fire round.
you very much, Cly Rochelle, or Ritual, for the five gifted. Gang, 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 gang. Dude, what is this? Oh, we probably need an Among Us sus shirt. wrap it up. I'm going to rapid fire and I'm going to pick the shirts. Okay, chat? And then I'm going to go record the pod. And then after I'm going to raid Cutie, by the way, who's doing a really long stream today. She's doing a charity stream. Uh, but she'll tell you more about that. Thank you if I get the coupon. Thank you the gifted chat. You guys have been really cool today. Uh, that's a fire shirt. Even though it won't be a vote, feel free to give your input, though. You can one and two still. All right. Link time is over. All right. We have only 20 shirts left. We are only going to get five of them. Those five shirts will be our final five shirts, and then that will make up the shirts we use for the photo shoot. That makes sense? Let's take a look at these. Starting with... Rar, I'm two. That's fire, dude. That's just like a sick shirt. That's a dope shirt. That's just a dope shirt. I think this might be the best shirt we've seen today. Two-year-olds really have it good. I'm glad they have this in men's sizes because I feel like as a 26-year-old, they don't give me that good of shirts anymore. You know, I don't get a cool shirt for being 26. When you're two, you're living the good life. Add it to the cart. Next. Get a load of this guy. And it's a, it looks like a little worm dude. It looks like a little worm dude. He's a cute little worm guy. Honestly, this would be a pretty fire shirt without the text. I feel like the text doesn't... It almost detracts in a way. So I'm going to pass. I flexed and the sleeves fell off. And the sleeves are on? This is what you wear when you want to play mind games before the match even starts. Wait, what match? <laughs> what, what did he... Ryan, what's going on here? What are you doing? I kind of respect Ryan in a way. The match? I wasn't going to get this, but I've been swayed by Ryan. A chess match? Yeah. Yeah, you face opposite of Magnus Carlsen. And you wear that shirt. And the Norwegian just stands there, confused. You're in his head. Yeah, I like this one. Let's cop. Canada sucks. Don't. Let's. Come on, guys. Can we? Can we please? For once. No, no, no. Stop the ones. Unironically. Can we stop the ones? Can we please uh, Drake and chat for the greatest shirt I've seen today? I mean, my God, my God. Recently found out there's only about 30 million people in the entire country of Canada. 
and I feel much more comfortable making fun of them because they make up such a small percentage of not only my viewership, but the world as a whole. They're like a fifth the size of Mexico even. So let's go. <laughs> It's okay if you don't like playing the trumpet. It's kind of a smart people instrument anyway. That's true. Do I still have my... All right, I lost a thousand viewers on that one. Uh, I think no, I think no for this. Skip this one. Feeling sussy. I think we just have to get it. I think we just have to get one Amoga's shirt. It seems like a necessity to get one Amoga's shirt. I'll go green because that's what I used to wear or play as. Your daughter does anal. I mean, just no questions asked, right? Just no questions asked. 2XL, put it on Hassan's body. Just, we don't got to complicate this. Just get a 2XL and make Hassan wear this shirt. Just don't, don't be weird about it. Not now, sweetie. Mommy cyberbullying the mayor. Just no questions asked. Put this on Will Neff's body. Just no, que just don't worry about it. Just no questions asked. Get this in a large and throw it on Will Neff's body. I love it when my mom lets me play video games. This shirt has 787 ratings. That's crazy. That's crazy. I'll pass this one though. I'll pass this one. Guess how much this top cost? What? It's 1200? Why? No. No chat, no ones. What the fuck? It it's not even funny if you don't know. What an insane marketing tactic to just sell a shirt for 1200 with the caption so that's like two people ironically buy it and you just make insane profit. <laughs> that's fucking insane. Get it? <laughs> this is insane. This is an insane thing to buy. If I do a vote and it gets above 85%, I'll get it. 500 votes and I'll stop though. Woof. Thank you, boys. Appreciate that. Appreciate that. Appreciate you guys. Appreciate you guys. Next, I eat asbestos. I just kind of like the lettering. Red lettering, all lowercase. I'm kind of a fan here. I kind of like this one. This is like a nice shirt. I think we're over 20, but I'm down to cop it. The really long hoodie from Cool Shirts. What the fuck? What? That's insane. $76? All right, we'll cop it. I met my wife on Ancestry.com. 
like a stupid incest joke. <laughs> All right, throw it on Connor Reed's pants, call it a day. I just want to drink beer and jerk my rod. Wait, what, what was our other fishing one? I'm so good with my rod, I make fish come. Wait, maybe we should get a bunch of fish ones so we can have like a fish, fish photo. Because the last one is also, fishing saved me from becoming a porn star. Now I'm just a hooker. <laughs> so we could get three fish one and then do a fish photo. <laughs> all right, we'll get all three. We'll get all three. We'll get all three. We'll have a fish one. We'll have a fish one. Last one. Daddio of the patio. I think we can pass. I think we can pass on Daddio of the patio. This is too unironic. You need Daddio of the patio. Why pass? All right, fuck it. We need another red shirt. We'll get it. We'll get it for the caller. And there it is, boys. There it is. There it is. That is, uh, it's like 20, it's like 30 shirts in total because a few of them I brought over here. But at least the ones on Amazon are Daddy of the Patio, Fishing Save Me. I just want to drink beer and jerk my rod. I met my wife on Ancestry.com. I eat asbestos. Don't, uh, not now, sweetie. Mommy's cyberbullying the mayor. Your daughter does anal. Feeling sussy. Canada sucks. I flexed, I flexed and le the sleeves came off. Raw rhyme too. I shave my balls for this. Blow me. This is my Ludwig costume. Mommy Milker's on board. May I suggest the sausage? I'm the psychotic dentist mom. I lubricate my AR-15 with liberal cum. I'm good with my rod. I make fish cum. Hulk mode, area 69. All I need is a little hit of coffee. I pause my hentai to be here. And then there's a few more as well. The Sonic one, the long sleeve one, the Nathan Fielder one, the gynecologist one, the male one. All of those are here. I just have to, it takes more to, the Ludwig dental, uh, mentally dating the Obama one are still there as well. Pogchamp one didn't win. We got about like 30 shirts in total. And next, yeah. I'm going to get everybody to do a photo shoot, hopefully sometime in the next week or two. And, uh, and we'll see how it turns out. We'll see how it turns out. But thank you, boys. I know it's been a, been a bit of a short stream and a, a, kind of a lack of streams lately. Honestly, if you look at like how much I've streamed in the past month, it's pretty fucking abysmal. Normally, I stream like 160, 150 hours. And I think in the past 30 days, I've streamed literally 125. Past seven, I've streamed 11. But uh, I've been a bit sick uh, and and just generally busy. But uh, everything should get back to usual starting this weekend uh, where we're just going to be co-commentating, co-casting Smash Summit 11, the biggest Smash tournament ever. Uh, so I'm looking forward to that. But uh, for tonight, boys, I'm out. Thanks for watching. I got to go record the podcast, The Yard. If you guys want, uh, go check out Cutie. She's doing a charity stream today. Uh, she does it every year. It's on... Um, the anniversary of when her mom passed away and this year she's raising money for Alveus uh, so if you guys want to uh, give her some love she's already raised fucking 30k which is insane uh, but if you don't got cash it's also fun you can just hang out uh, anyway here it is twitch.tv forward slash cutie and I will see you all tomorrow for sure. Hopefully early. Hive Minds at 6 p.m. I hope you'll have a bit earlier. See you guys. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it. Have a good rest of your night, everyone. Bye. See you guys. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it.